everybody, what the fuck is up? Welcome back to Cooking with Bird Martinez. The one, the only bird motherfucking Dines, bitch. And Marvelous Mandy is in the motherfucking house. <coughs> so today, I'm gonna give my shout out to the beginning because last time I forgot and I was like, fuck, people wanna hear their little shout outs in the beginning, you know? Sí. Not in the middle or when I forget or whatever. So, first, um, I wanna tell my little Mandy I'm sorry that you don't get to, you know, complete your eighth grade year. It's my first child that's gonna be a high schooler in on month on next year. Well, this year, September. And it was special because remember your Hitterat days and as an eighth grader? I remember those Hitterat days. They were so innocent and so pure. And then you turn into a piece of shit in high school. Not really, you won't. But like eighth grade is like the last year of your innocence, I feel. Well, for me, I like boys. I only have crushes and then you know, I went to high school and it was like, I turned in Lucy, you know, I didn't turn into Lucy, <laughs> but I don't know. I just, I'm, I'm sorry, but it's fine. I know, but I feel bad. I, I'm trying to suck it in. I'm trying to be gangster. No, I'm not trying to be gangster. I'm just trying to suck it in and not be like, toda mamona. Because Mandy knows I'm a little, I'm a big ass teddy bear, a skinny teddy bear. <laughs> I'm just like a thing. You know, I cry a lot. But I don't cry because I'm, like, depressed right now. I cry because I have feelings. And I feel that when you have feelings, you're supposed to show them holes. You're supposed to express yourself. And sometimes you just got to cry a little bit. Okay. So, this one's... Ugh. Shout out to Jessica and Jaden from El Paso, Texas, from your sister, Paula. Um, a couple of days ago, she was um, tested for the coronavirus, and she came out positive. And right now she's isolated from her family, you know, she's recovering. And she told me in the message that she has never felt this sick before and she does not even wish that shit on her worst enemy. Like that's how fucking crazy it is. Her name is Paula, aka Betty. Her middle name is Beatriz. Shout out baby girl, you know what I'm saying? We got this. I know it's crazy, it's scary, but I wish wishing you speedy recovery. And you know, message me whenever you want. I estoy ahí. You know, trying to write back to you motherfuckers because I love you. Um, also, um, my girl Ellie Musquez wants to wish her chorizo, Daniel, happy birthday to you. Uh, uh, uh. Happy birthday to you. Uh, uh, uh. Man, he's like, I'm so uncomfortable. Este, his birthday was on Wednesday, but you know, I said it today. So today, Mandy, what are we going to do? Chorizo? Longaniza, oh. chorizo, it's the same thing. Chorizo, longaniza, is the same thing. It's the consistency is different. But we're gonna do a little remix. Um, We're gonna do, you know how there's longaniza de puerco? That's the main one, the pork one. We're gonna do a turkey one. I never had a turkey chorizo, longaniza. I'm doing this video because there was a girl that wanted me to send her some longaniza. She said she would pay and she'd pay the shipping and everything. But I was like, mejor les enseño. I'd rather sí. teach him so, because food is kind of like, ugh. So I'll make a turkey one, and then I'm gonna make a, a pork one. So I bought pork lion filet, and I bought some pork fat. Pork, you know, it's always good with the fat. Mandy was like, why is it so cheap? 347, remember? See? 347 for 230, cause it's just the fat, but it's the good, good stuff. Also, we're gonna use chile guajillo. Um, this one was cheap, two, 265. We're gonna use some garlic. And of course, my little horse, we're gonna use some black pepper, chine, cayenne, cayenne pepper, or okay, cayenne, well, I don't know, cumin, we're gonna use thyme, oregano, onion powder, and some salt for that ass. That's a lot. That's a lot of stuff. But it's because that's what it is with the longaniza chorizo. It has a lot of flavor. They always tell you to try it, but you're always like, I like my steak. Steak is life. You like to be comfortable and you like what you like, but that's good too. But me, I'm like, I like to explore and dive in the chorizo, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and also, we're gonna use some vinegar. Ya casi no tengo. Whatever it is. Vinegar, apple vinegar. But you could use um piña vinegar. That's the one that we should use. So anyways, bitch, here we go. Where am I jumping? I don't know. I don't really, really know. Cause Mandy, she's like, she's like her dad. I just posted a video on Instagram and where I'm cutting your puppy's hair. And Mandy's just like this. And I said something about cutting his dick off, and he had a little giggle, and that was it. Literally, that's what Mario does. He does not like to socialize at all. He is like Mr. But Mandy, she does like to socialize. 
She likes smart people, though. She don't like no lemon heads. If you come to her and you're talking about some shit that she doesn't find interesting, she will, like, hear your fucking voice and it just will go. But if you say some shit, like some interest, interesting stuff that you guys have in common, she won't shut the fuck up and she'll school you <laughs> on that subject. Like, the other day she was telling me about the Latinas. We were going to make a video about this, right? Yeah. What happened with the Latinas? So, we're the last people or group in the United States to vote. Yep. I did not know that. We are the last people. Even Latino men voted before Latina women. Yeah. Before Asian people. Black people. Everybody voted before Latina women. Bitch, that needs to be spoken about. And I was like, yes, Mandy, the intellectual Mandy. Because people don't even talk about that. And it's a subject, and that's why, you know, it's important to talk about these things. Because right now, we're going through some shit. But it's also time to learn, motherfucker. Yeah. That's for this. We're also going to use sheep casings. So it's the stuff like the chorizo goes into like a thingy and it has salt and I, I've never worked with these but today we're gonna learn together motherfuckers so let's do this also of course my little horse you're gonna need a molcajete no cierto you don't need one but it's better when you get one bitch it's gonna help me is to peel the garlic we go like this if you smash it too hard it gets flat you're just supposed to smash it like kind of like in the middle medium mira mira que chulada I love garlic Bitch, I don't even, I love, I don't know who do I love more, garlic or onion? I don't know. I don't know. I love them both. I can't live without them. But anyways, bitch, last night we were watching Finally, Finally. We watched the movie Parasite. Is that what it's called? See? That shit was fire. No wonder fucking, it said, ¿Cómo se llama? I was going to say Donald, Donald President. <laughs> what the fuck? Is Donald name? Trump. Donald Trump. He fucking got all pissed off because they went to the Oscars and shit. They won all kinds of awards. Oh, only one Oscar thing. Oh. Well, they did it. Like, was it from North Korea? South Korea. South Korea? And he's like, oh, the fucking movie's not even in English. Whoop -de -whoop -whoop. It didn't need to be in English, bro. It did not need to be in English. That shit was fucking fire. Um, let me let me bring Sophia so she could tell you her favorite part. Hey, Sophia is too busy for us today. She is cleaning her shoes. We were cleaning under the bed and um, we found like treasures. We found some shoes that she couldn't find in. How long? Two years. Two years. We haven't even had him for two years. Yeah. Sophia has her. Damn. Timeline all messed up. <laughs> she says like three years ago. I'm like, three years ago, you were like five. Este, what was, oh, spoiler alert on that ass. What was your favorite part of the movie? When the daughter was trying to help the dad. Yeah, because she's like, that's something I would do for my puppy to try to get him a job and shit. But oh man, people always fuck up when they open doors. In the movies, I'm like, why you open the fucking door, bro? Why you always open the fucking door? We over here, we don't open doors. Uncle Fuck, unless they say, is a police, is a motherfucking pope post. Yeah. Every time they knock the motherfucking door up in this hole, these bitches run like, <laughs> they run. And we're traumatized. We're traumatized. We have child services called on our ass. You know, and it's like scary. So, you know, if you're thinking of calling child services on somebody, just remember to think about it. Cause we went through it and <laughs> no huh? I'm by okay, so meanwhile we are peeling the chiles también and you know giving cheese me over here. Saying some cheese me. So I used to say cheese, not cheese me. And um Mario calls me yesterday, right? He called me and I was like, I'm driving, he always wants me to answer, but then he says I shouldn't um drive and talk or whatever and um then mandy i said mandy read the text and it says papi says he has some cheese and i was like hold up wait a minute let's skirt, skirt, stop this motherfucking car and take a minute to see what the fuck the cheese mint was and what the fuck was the cheese mint? <gasps> talking about cheese man i have a cheese mint for mario okay so it's not a good you know there's a friend that i have from back in the day and she's always said, oh, you know, I let, I let, I look up to you. She's, she's younger than me. She says she looks up to me because I'm happy all the time. This is a person before all this, you know, YouTube shit. And um, she she would tell me nice things like that. So she was married to this fuckboy, right? And I know, you know, whatever. He was always cheating on her. He was always, you know, not giving her money for the damn groceries and shit like that. He wouldn't let her wear makeup. He wanted to get her pregnant all the time. You know, fuck boys. So anyways, this fuck boy never changed his ways. Four babies deep. Like, she already had four kids with him. And um, he 
left her for a fucking another girl. And the crazy part is that other girl, she's from the hood too. Like, what the fuck is you doing? You know, she's like somebody that I, like, I wouldn't get with him. He friend requested me on Facebook, but I was like, hell to the not. Like, I already know your type. So he left his wife or whatever for this new new girl. I was gonna say bitch, but I don't know. <laughs> and um, motherfucker killed himself. Yeah. And now it's a whole thing. Like she's pregnant. She's pregnant. The new bitch is pregnant, and he. Oh my hell, nah. When my mom called me, I was like, what the fuck? She's like, I don't know why he killed himself. And, da -da -da -da. and I'm like, well, he's always been a little out there. And I'm not trying to bash a dead person. But I feel like sometimes when people die and they were not good people, every time they die, they're like, oh, como dicen? He was a sweet person. He brought a smile to the world. And he lighted up the room. He let, lighted up the room. Lit up the room. He lit up the room. <laughs> he lit up the room. But this motherfucker didn't lit up anything. You know, I'm sorry. And I know... I mean, I fuck with his mom and I fuck with the family, but you know, it is what it is. So we're peeling the estos chiles. Let me go show Mario the Back chiles. and everybody and their mama is hungry. So I'm making some sandwiches. Yesterday I made Italiano sandwiches. And they came out pretty bomb. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they did. Pretty bomb skis, skis, motherfuckers. You hear that noise as the motherfucking microwave. It's the, I'm gonna take a little break to finish cooking up for the familia. And then I'll come back to the chorizo, <laughs> to the longaniza. These are the sandwiches. It's the, I used to work in Subway. You know, I used to be a sandwich artist. That's what they said on my apron. That's when I got in trouble. Okay, porque my manager, he fucking robbed the damn safe. And when the detectives, detectives were talking to me, they said, do you know who it was? And I knew it was him because even though he covered his face, I kind of knew. Cause I don't chaparrito, you know. And then um, he was like, "No." The detective was like, "I know, you know." And I said, "No," and because I didn't talk, because I didn't say anything, because in my head it's like my mentality was like, "Oh, I don't snitch, snitches, fuck snitches, get stitches." So then they picked me up at six in the morning at my house to say that to like arrest me, and they took me, and it was crazy because the cops were making fun of me. There's something wrong. The cops were making fun of me. They're like, oh, you live in the ghetto. You live in the hood. Because there was like a dog without a leash. And they're like, who lives in a hood? Who lives in a place with a dog with no leashes? They were just clowning on me, bro. And it was it was very, very crazy, but whatever. Look at that shit. Mira que chulada. I'm just going to add the black pepper. Yeah. I use my molcajete too. It's perfect for to make a steak a la plancha. I don't know what the fuck they call it. But I put the steak underneath, I put a skillet, and then I put the mocajete with the rock for more, you know, so it could be more heavy. This, I was taught by a lady that she said it was the first thing she learned how to cook because she didn't know how to cook steak, and she just did it like that. And ever since then, boom, boom. Motherfucker, so now Mandy's gonna clean the pig meat. It's the, always wash that ass and wash the pig meat like you're washing that ass. Very, very importante. We're also gonna add once we cut it up, we're gonna cut it up in very, very thinly pieces. We're gonna put some vinegar on that ass, para que se desinfecte y se ponga bien limpio. Also very, very importante. Very importante to este, ¿cómo se dice? Sharpen your knife. Sharpen your knife, like you sharpen a pencil. Mandy was going like this and like that, but all you gotta do, <laughs> that, see? It's nice and good and thick. And yeah, that's my little remix right there, un desmadre. I have that toaster that. ¿Cómo se llama el señor que me dio el toaster? Um, Limmy. Limmy. Limmy, sorry. I have your toaster, Limmy. Don't worry, I already told you what's gonna happen with that. <clears throat> but, anyways, let's do it. Wow, wow, got it, got it. So, we're just gonna cut it like this. I'm showing you Mandy, she's gonna be the one that's gonna do it. Este, usually people use like a molino, like when you put it, you know, when they make this, the ground beef, they use that. Oh. But we don't have one of those but it's good because it's gonna come out bomb because of the damn pieces you know it's gonna be like see do you get it see it's like ground beef perfection it's like couldn't find any pork ground beef but i was like even better because I, I like it like thicker pieces so we're gonna do all that i see bitch i got something in the mail 
Every time we get something in the mail, like Christmas, huh, Mandy? See, the kids, they're like, what do we get? What do we get? Now, baby Mario, right now, he wants me to make him fries. He's addicted to fries. One week is addicted. No, one week his food is cup of noodles. The other week is sandwiches. And then this week is fries. Chichamaco cabo. Spoiled little bread. Yeah. Que chulada. Damn, Mandy, you got skillies. She took culinary class two times. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like you're in school. It's culinary class in my oh, yeah. house. Yes. So there's also, like, Mario got me this. Um, You get, like, the top of, like, a Coca-Cola bottle. And, you know, cut it. You know where the where you pour the drink? And you could use that to put the chorizo in. Or the meat in, like that. But he said, it was nine bucks in Amazon. 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 Talking about Amazon, people. Motherfuckers, it's crazy. It's the... They refuse to shut down. There's people protesting. No, man, they, See? There's people protesting and shit. And when they protest or speak the fuck up, they get fired. That's some fucking bullshit. That motherfucker is like a fucking trillionaire. Trillionaire? Billionaire? See? He's a billionaire. No? Uh-huh. Like, what's the point? Man, that's why I never want to be rich like that. People lose their mind. They lose um, the value of real people. They, like, what's the point of having money if you can't? In the times of crisis, you can help others. Now he donated money, ten million, but because he has to, it's like he fucked up. So now he wants to look like Mr. Goody Two Shoes. But the once you break the glass, you can still see the cracks of the motherfucker, even if you glue that bitch. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, this has nothing to do with the recipe. It's the baby Mario wanted some fries, so I'm just peeling some potatoes, potato tomatoes. And I'm gonna put it in water, make them real quick. You guys, you guys ever notice? I have this in the back. This is I recycle the oil like three times, and then um, cause you use a lot of oil when you make rice. And I don't got money for that right now. La cucaracha's here. First time I hear in the whole day. He always goes in front of the house, cause he knows your girl. Is, is here, lives here. The ice cream and the cucaracha man, they all like me. Even the liquor store guy. Oh, shout out to Dominic. Who was that? What was Courtney? Courtney. The girl from the U um the post office. Okay, so every time I go take my salsas, I have a hard time because motherfuckers always give me a hard time, right? But there's this girl named Courtney. She is the realest bitch ever born. You know. If I don't have something right, she says, just go get a box and we'll redo it. And she helped me write the address down. Mm -hmm. That's a real bitch right there. Shout out to you. I know maybe you don't watch me. I told her about my channel, but I don't know if she did it. I like, I said, you know, I cook and I curse. And she started laughing straight up. Anyways, oh, Mario told me to ask you guys if anybody's selling some dumbbells. Dumbbells, Mandy? Some weights over 60 pounds. He's been looking trying to buy them, but they're all sold out. You know, he loves to work out um, Or an incline a decline? decline bench or something Please let me know And stay I'll buy them. I Just want I just want him to keep keep himself healthy and sane and that's what he does He works out and that's his therapy. So right now. He's kind of like You know he can't go to the gym and that was his thing. Literally, he would go to the gym and come back home like all energized. And then my culito had to like suffer. I was running around like, he's all chasing me like a fucking horn dog. But anyways, there you go. We are baby Mario's fries. Um, That's how my mama made them. That's how I make them. Sometimes I do use frozen fries. Pero como ahorita, you know, I, the shit's happening. So I bought a lot of frozen, um, a lot of frozen, a lot of potatoes, papas. And I just have them there and they last a very long time. And it's quickly, quickly garlic. It's the, it's not dirty. That's how it looks when it dries up. It's the, I'm just gonna smash them up and get all the shit ready. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get the oregano ready and everything. So this takes a little bit of time, but it's all in the wrist. You know what I'm saying? You go like this, boom. I'm gonna teach you guys how to use this bitch. Muy chingona y se me cayó el pinchazo. Sideways, I guess. Like that. And then I'm gonna add the oregano, no, the cumin. Because that's what's gonna give it flavor, flavor. Y también el oregano, bitch. Little by little, remix everything. It's 
gonna start smelling good, bitch. Good, good. And I'm gonna put half of it here and half of it in the, no, half of it in the pork one and half of it in the turkey one. Woo! It's gonna be good. Oh, you know what? No, I'm gonna put everything in the sauce. Yeah, I'm gonna put everything in the red sauce. Yay, half and half. Como sale. Add a little bit of water just to remix it. Pa que agarre. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Jelly motherfucking bean. You know what? I'm so happy that I got all these bad bitches, you know, supporting me. Because you guys fucking rock. You guys see, I got 15,000 subscribers. Woo, woo, woo. Thank you to every one of you from the bottom of my motherfucking butthole. No, I'm just kidding. From the bottom of my heart, bitch. Hey, motherfuckers. So now we're going to add the onion powder y también the thyme leaf. We're going to throw it up in that bitch. Up in that bitch. It's the measurements. Yo digo que half a tablespoon. Ah, pero que mierda. Okay, there you go. Have a tablespoon. You know, when it comes to seasoning, everybody's different. Some people like more shit. Some people like less shit. But for longaniza, it's supposed to be flavorful. It's supposed to have like a lot of, you know, a lot of flavor. Y ahorita I'm gonna add el otro también. Ahora sí, el este cayenne. I don't even know how to fucking say it. Bitch, bitch, so there you go, baby Mario's fries. Mira que chulada. I'm just gonna add some um, ketchup, right? Yeah. Papi. ¿Tan buenas las fries? Pinche cabrón. Peace, you want me to leave? I'm annoying. <laughs> First, my little horse. Este, I'm gonna add a little bit of chicken flavoring. I feel that of all of them, the tomato one, the damn beef one, all of them, this one, the chicken flavor one, is the best one. Bitch, you guys always see my fucking mapeador there, right? So, I went to the cucaracha and I got a new one for $5. Yes, $5. Let me show you guys that beauty. Look at this, bitch. Oh my god. It's like the Mexican, Mexican one. And it's the, it says right here Guatemala and Mexico. From the 626. That's crazy. See, I don't know what the beef is, Guatemalans and Mexico. Every time I see a Guatemala Salvadorian fucking restaurant, I always see tacos too. I feel like, you know, but anyways. um, So these are the ones that I use, but I never had gotten this color. Anyway, and um, the, I'm not going to take it out of the package. Oh, here you go. No, but it goes like this and it's really good to mop. And then the wood thing, you press it really hard like this and your house will be spotless clean. I'm telling you, aquí está su twin brother. No, they're not twins because they don't look the same. Good. Mira que chulada. What up, girl? How you doing? I'm good. How the fuck are you? Why the fuck do you smell, girl? I don't know, bitch. At least I don't smell like poochie, like, bitch. You want to fight? Because I'm going to fight you. You know we friends. I, you know, I use you every day. You better calm your ass down. Okay, but next time better do my hair, bitch. The fuck? I'm going to put a little bit of vinaigre on that ass. No mucho, no más pa' que agarre, you know? Gonna remix that whole, and we're gonna cover it because Mandy says that the meat is not supposed to be exposed to the air. To the air. Say it, Mandy, say it, preach. The meat? Oh yeah, so the, we leave the pig or meat to the air a long time. Bacteria might get to it and you might get sick. Yeah, bitch, I see fucking videos of Mexico um, when I was little in Mexico. When my parents, my mom would go to Mexico, they would kill the fucking cow and fucking goat and all these shits everywhere. And they would leave the meat and the flies would be flying around. And we never got sick. That was the fucking crazy part. Like, why didn't we get sick and now everything gets us sick? Maybe because they were organic. So don't panic. Here is, um... Pork meat and here's the turkey meat. That one already bought it. It's the it's like ground beef or what? Ground beef turkey. I don't know what the fuck. Chilitos, my lovers over here. I love you guys. I'm just gonna toast them a little bit. Para que, you know that you could boil them if you want, but I'm toasting them because that's how I do it. And then I'm gonna put it in this container and then we're gonna put them with water. Then we're gonna blend that whole. Porque when you put these in the mocajete, girl, we'll be here forever and ever and ever and ever. Y yo no quiero estar aquí forever. I want to be with my chorizo, Mario Martinez. He's waiting for me. 
Hello, and he's like, take your time, do what you do. I said, today he went to work at six in the morning and we got home at three, right? So I was remembering when we were young, este, when I was 18, I would always wait for him because it was like just me and him. I didn't have no friends here. And um, I would wait. I was like, okay, it's six. And I was it, like at 550, I would wait outside for him. And just wait and wait, you know, young and loving and shit. And then when I had a baby, we would go outside and wait for him. And then today I was like, man, I don't want to change. You know, that's what makes you like, you know, a couple when you keep shit, you know, fresh, but also some tradition. I went outside and I was waiting for him like I used to. And I was like, we've been together for so long. And you know, all the memories, all the fights, all the whatever. And I was sad because I was like, man, with all this going on, because people dying and shit, can we have said without Mario? What am I going to do without my Mario? There's no Eric, there's no bird Erica without Mario. There's no Mario. So you have your loved ones right now, you know, cherish them. Porque nunca se sabe. Not just because of this fucking bitch ass how coronavirus. You digo for life, just because, you know, remind them how much you love them. Sometimes, yes, I'm a bitch to Mario. I'm like, I'm not perfect. I'm not like the perfect wife. Cooks and cleans. No, no, no. hell, motherfucking ass, no. You know, I'm like, no, 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 no. but I don't, you know, like I used to when I was younger. I toned it way the fuck down. Only when something bugs me, that's when I say it. Because there's no reason to be fighting unnecessarily, like for, for not a for not a reason. When I was young, I was always jealous, and I was always like, oh, he's gonna leave me because I don't look the same or whoop, whoop, whoop. But, you know, men love them some fucking confident ass bitch. I noticed that when I was confident and I was like, you know, I don't know, 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 he loved me more than when I was like, men love real bitches. So I can get the color and all the juices in there. These start getting like loosey. So, you know, it's better. It's all good in the hood. Ready, Freddy. Ahorita nomás voy a ver esto, how you use it. Pero you know what? Psh, I'm Mexican. It's in my blood, bitch. The fuck? Refrigerate after opening. Okay. Just looks like fresh natural sheep casings. Not iodized salt. Non iodized salt. What is that? Iodized salt is like that fake salt, huh? Mm hmm. Let's do this. So before I continue, I want to show my little box that I got. Oh my gosh, I fucking love it when I get stuff. Like, everything's so special to me, and I'm keeping every motherfucking single note. So when I'm old and crusty and nobody loves me, I'm going to go back and read it and be like, you know what? Once upon a time, my, oh, I was young. And is my accent going to change? No. I used to have a YouTube channel. You know what I'm saying? And motherfuckers rock with me. You know? You know what I mean? Jelly motherfucking bean. It's for gang, 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 motherfuckers. Yep, that's going to be me. So, this is from... To Bird and the wonderful Martinez family. I made these bitches myself. I hope you like. Este, most of them, my, most of my scents are unique. Do you like candles? I love candles. Como se llama? I know his name. Pero voy a ir acá porque voy a get my headers out. Peter. Peter Camacho, my tío loco. That's what he calls himself. Este, you know what? Fun fact is that, fun fact, mira que mamona, este, back in the day, my great grandma, Alfonsina, I look up to her so much because she was bad, bitch. Este, she made candles by hand, and she didn't even have a house, like a wooden house or a brick house like they were in Mexico. She had a hay house. Yes, a house made of hay, sticks, whatever the fuck you want to call it. But she was so proud of that shit. She was a, una cabrona. And um, inside her little hay house, you you would think that it's kind of fucking crazy in there, but no. And we'll go in there, and she had a lot of wax and candles and shit. And um, she made them and sold them. And she lived till like 103. And I'm so sad because I never got to see her again. She gave me a donkey when I was a little girl. A black donkey, la burra prieta. That's what she called it. And then her husband sold it for alcohol. But... Her husband were beat her ass, beat her ass, beat her ass. And then, you know, she fucking finally just started ignoring him. And then he would start screaming at her. And she was like, Caiga un loco que no haya dos. Let it there be one crazy, not two. 
so when before he died he made like um two things cemetery things two holes one for him one for her so he died first and she's like, fuck you, fool. I'm not going to fucking be for the rest of my life with that, with you. So she bought her own terreno and he was alone. She was not with him. And I just thought that was a bad bitch move. Like, fuck you. You made me stop. She wasn't going to divorce him either because it was Mexico, you know. But anyway, still. Mm, okay, okay. So I got here the special remix orange chili pepper. He made it in damn self, he said. I really love Wally. Mmm. It's like orangey, but um, makes me want to eat it. Orangey with a little sweetness. If I when I wear perfume, I like este. No estoy comiendo. I like um sweet, sweet stuff. I don't, I don't know. And this one's called Volcano Blue. Mmm. This one tastes, smells like taste. This one smells like candy, like blue candy, like that blue candy, like the ring pop. Okay, okay, I see you. Copper coconut. It's gonna smell like coconut, huh? I'm gonna use these motherfuckers. Oh, bitch. It smells like coconut, but not too coconutty. Like coconut with coconut with some crema. With some of my bitch Daisy right there. Yes. Oh, you put a little bird on it. Oh, so cute. Oh, thank you. I'm gonna put the I guess I put that in there. I like this. I like the, the little decoration. I love it. You know the other day we went to this this store in the valley where the masks, the face masks were like ten dollars for ten. It was so stupid. And um they had like the these type of stuff. And Sophia was like, Oh my god, mommy, look. And I was like, fifteen dollars for like this, and then each thing costs money. I was like, fuck that. We can save our money. So I appreciate this. I'm going to light this bitch up. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mira que chula. I love it. I fucking love it. I fucking love everything I get. <laughs> you don't even know. I'm like a, I'm like an appreciative, appreciated little bitch. I love it. And then my little note note. It's going to go right here next to the rest. Thank you so much. I love you. So now Sofia's in the house. We're gonna add the chiles, right? Los chiles los vamos a moler. We're gonna blend them for a good hot minute because we want it to be very, very, very remixed. Because since it's gonna go in the longaniza, we want it to get the most chile that we can. It looks so good. That looks good, right? Mm -hmm. Ugh, bitch, I just heard. Well, my mom called me. She told me that the tomatoes are gonna go up, like the price. Because um, what's going on, the farmers aren't working or some shit. I don't know, but I'm going to be pissed off, man. I need my food to be happy. I need my tomatoes, my cilantro, my aguacate, my chili. This is, this is me, bitch. And I'm going to show Sofia. So when you put the chili, ah, pendeja. I hate it when this top goes down. So you're going to go like that. You don't put that much. Don't put it up because then it's going to get all over. So then you go like this. Se quiten todas las seeds que you know, we couldn't get. And the chile, the cascara. The cascara is the skin. A ver si cascara. Cascara. Cas. Cas. Ca. Ca. La. A la. No. Casca. Casca. No, ca. Like casca. Casca. A la. A la. Casca. Where the fuck do you get a la? It's cascara. A cascara. 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 <laughs> desgraciada. A ver, di desgraciada. Ascasada. A ver, di ashkere. Ashkere. You, so you can say that, but you can't say a basic word. <laughs> so you're going to go like this again. Mommy. Because mm. if, if you don't take out all the seeds, you will get the thing. Mm -hmm. What's it called? It's bad, bad for your gut bladder. Yes. Because see, these, it, it, they don't dissolve. So when they go in your body, they get stuck there también. Because it's skin, it's like, you know? But like the lemon skin, it dissolves all that other stuff. But esta no. Estamos de tercos, you know, Mexicans eating the damn skin and the seeds and all that. I wonder if the tomato skin is bad for you. Because I've seen a lot of videos when people take it off. 
but i've always felt that the tomato skin it actually like dissolves this one it doesn't so you're not gonna put it yeah it's all big Ooh, i love this i swear one day i'm gonna make a lipstick out of this bitch this color is this exact color and i'm gonna call it chile guajillo for that ass y luego i'm gonna have one que se llame cilantro that's gonna be green Green? A green lipstick? Yeah, because I am always trying to look for green lipstick and there's none. Yeah, because there's people like you that like shit like that. My, your hand gets tired. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Sophia's gonna do it. So, espérate, pues. Pay okay. attention. Eres bien acelerada. You're gonna go like this, right? Mm -hmm. And then you're gonna go like this. Okay? Okay. So, I go like this and No, not too hard. Did you see me doing it hard? No. Now, I'm gonna put a little bit of water. Try to get the rest of the stuff. I'm not giving you the heavy one. I'm giving you the a little bit of water. A ver. Ahora sí. Do it like I did it. No, in this part. Así, mira. Sí? Can I, this? can I go there? Yeah, go there. You're going to take my place one day anyways. No, hold it like this. Like this. All right. And mm -hmm. then, see. So this is moving? Yeah. Why are you looking at the camera? Look at what you're doing, mamona. <laughs> Ahí, pinche Sofía, mira. Right, now put your hand inside. You already washed your hands. Okay. And push it in. <laughs> it's fun, huh? Can I do it by myself now? Yeah, do it by yourself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's done. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mira que chula, It's so beautiful. You're so beautiful to me. Y acá está el otro remix. This is the one with the flavor. You want to taste it, Sofía? Is it spicy? No, it's not spicy. It's just a seasoning. Mm. I, I know it's a lot, but it's gonna go there. Okay, so I already got this. I'm only gonna use these. It's cold. It says to use cold water, rinse them, and then for 10 minutes, we're gonna leave them there, I guess. That's what the instructions say. I'm using half of the thing that I, that, um, that they came with. They're all nuts and shit. You better work, bitch. I've seen my grandma do this, but I've never done it. But you know, como like I said, it must be my motherfucking blood, bitch. Oh, mira. There is. I've seen fucking my tios has to kill cows and she tons of chingadera. That I'm just used to it, bitch. Oh, that's doing that's happening, or what that's doing that's happening. We're gonna add the remix to the. Um, salsa we're gonna add the remix to the other remix and then we're gonna remix that bitch to the motherfucking remix it looks so good it reminds me of christmas blue or red it reminds you of what christmas blue no blue and red it's green and red that's <laughs> you loca <laughs> but it looks a little christmasy like the colors yeah i get why you would say that well five cents every day i'm gonna add more salt because it needs it it does it does indeed, indeed. Always taste your shit before I put it in it. Before, yeah, before you know, as they give it to people before cooking it and giving it to people. Mm -hmm. A little bit more, porque también necesita la sal para que agarre. You know, like um, the meat, so it's gonna get in there and shit. Oh, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be so good. I think I'm gonna add a little bit of more oregano. I love oregano. Here we go, yo. Paramos el oregano así. And sprinkle that bitch like this. Mm. It's a lot of salsa. Mm. You're eating a banana, it smells like banana and chili. Mm. Is that good smell? It smells funny. Like, mm. <laughs> like chile and banana? Like, what the fuck? What the fuck is going on? Okay. I see you. Perfection, I see. It smells good. Mm. Now, I'm going to add the chile. And Sofia's going to remix it. Don't use both hands. So you can have a hand free. You know what I'm saying? Porque lo vas a estar llena de... Chile. De chile y luego. I can touch my eyes. Hmm? Then I can't touch your eyes. Yeah, then you can't touch your eyes. Look at that shit. Ha <laughs> ha! It looks amazeballs. 
<laughs> Andale, pues tú. You could do it with a spoon or you could do it with whatever. That's how I put chili in my nose, actually. You put chili in your nose? Yeah. ¿Y por qué hiciste una mamada así? I don't know. The chili I'll be here, I could use it for, if I have left, I could use it for some enchiladas también. Oh. Unos chilaquiles. Ay, güey. You could use your hands, mommy. I like to use the spoon. But we wanted to get it in there. Yes. So roll up those leaves and get dirty. You like it anyway. Yeah. So smushy. It is smushy. Smushy like your Lucy. <laughs> Who's Lucy? It is. Lucy for that pussy. <laughs> it A is ver. Lucy's private part. Lucy's private part. A ver, vamos a echarte más chilito a ti. Mm -hmm. I saved it for next time. You know what I'm saying? Never throw away your salsa. Don't throw. Please don't. We could save these salsa lives. You know what I'm saying? Always put them away. Te digo unas pinos pinches chilaquiles. No mames, güey. No mames. That's why the vinegar. But anyways, the one, the pork one, it does have vinegar, but it has the white vinegar. This one's gonna have a little bit of apple vinegar. Apple. You're supposed to use pineapple vinegar. Chinga su madre. Got what I got. Yeah? I think apple vinegar is the best. Yeah? Yeah. Me too. I like the white one también because the white one you could clean a lot of stuff with it. It was pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. And so this one's a turkey one. And the other one it was pork one. It looks este. I'm gonna put the meat in here. A ver cómo sale esta mamada. We're gonna put la meat ahí. In the capsule? I think I got him too thin. I want him thicker. Pero es que pinche, like, the websites, they don't... That's why I wanted to go to the damn store and buy it. I like shit to... I like to buy stuff in the store. Because online shit pisses me off. Because sometimes I don't get what I want. What I really, really want. And I wanted some fucking big ones. But chingas madre, I'm trying. You don't pay what you get? No, it's because when you buy shit online and they show you a picture. And then, you know, something else comes. Like this one, the this skin, sheep, whatever casting, it had good reviews, but I'm blowing it up. Or maybe, I don't know, I, was, I need to like try it out before I start to keep talking shit. The thing on the thing, Sophia already gave up, she's tired. And boom. Wow. Wow, it looks like a weenie. I have to grab it good because it's not since it's about to That's cool. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. A ver, let me move the camera so you can get a Mira que chulada. It's like some skinny longanisa, but it's okay. Este, they have some other silicone shit. But my grandma always saw her that she used the sheep one. So, that's what I decided to use. Mario, that chorizo, he's getting all excited, huh, Mario? No. <laughs> <laughs> Mira, este sistema está llegando larguito, larguito, larguito. Larguito como un pito. Okay, we're gonna go watch this. After this, we're gonna go watch Netflix. My, Mandy was telling me we're gonna watch a, a narco one? Si. Sí. ¿De qué es? The dragon. El dragón. El dragón? Sí. Oh, God. Tanta pinche novela que hay. I wish I didn't unsee the Tiger King and see it again. The space, and then I'm gonna make a knot. Para que no se salga. I like these, but they're too skinny. I like my chorizo thick. I'm not all about the, you know, long. I like him thick. That's why I got me a Mario. I don't like me. Pero mira, salieron chingones. Mira que chulada. Ooh, 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 ooh. Here we go, yo. Yo to the, this is the, um, which one is this one? This one's a pork one. This is the one that we chopped up. So I don't know if it's gonna be too thick. Ooh, yes, queen, yes. Bitch, I get so happy because it worked out. So this is gonna be a two video part or whatever porque I wanna, you know, show you guys how the, I wanna cook it and shit. But this is the part I'm just showing you how to make it. Y luego tomorrow, mañana, este, we're gonna let it rest or whatever in la noche. Para que agarre flavor. 
and then we'll make a vi I'll make a video to taste it and show you different ways how to eat it. I wanna expand your horizon. So what I learned is that you know if you just push it, it's gonna like rip. So you press it down and then you push this thing up like that and then you keep moving this thing like that press it down and don't be scared it's not that thin it's like actually strong i think there's stitches sophia you know they make those stitches when your vagina rips when i was in the hospital and i had you i ripped and they put stitches made out of this so i don't have to go back and redo it like get my stitches removed they actually disappear or dissolve or whatever so, refill it i have to turn this bitch back up like this and then refill it with me and then you know my says it's a lot of work huh i don't know i like a lot of work i like to like find figure out um explore shit and then be like oh my god i did it bitch i did it hey motherfuckers so this is what it looks like so this one is the um i'm gonna say about the pork one and this one is a turkey one. You know what I'm saying? I feel like you could do it with the turkey too, but cut it up. Because see how the consistency, and you can see the little fat part. Bitch, this is going to be bomb skis, skis, motherfuckers. Also, this is going to be part one. Tomorrow, I'm going to make part two. I'm going to show you guys what it tastes like. Of course, it's going to be fucking bomb. And I'm going to make the rest. I want to see how much I could make like out of that. I could make a lot, porque con... Con poquito, I mean, I use like that little thing every time I wash to put some bleach on it. Um, because you know, gotta stay clean. Pero mira que chulada, I'm in fucking in love. In love with the chorizo, the longanisa. Uh, 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 uh. But, anyways, motherfuckers, I hope you guys like this video. I'm at the end of the video. I always taste the stuff, but you know what I'm saying? Mañana. Um, don't forget. That I love you guys. To our, oh, the raffle is tomorrow, bitch. Oh, shit. The raffle is tomorrow, five time California time. I'm going to go live on that ass. Thank you for the support. Thank you for the motherfucking love. Sophia's wearing her favorite lipstick. She found it, found it in my old fanny pack. But anyways, motherfuckers, to our, my bird gang, 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 motherfuckers. Peace and motherfucking. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're watching the corona video for, um. Many mm -hmm. school and they're all like wash your hands. But yeah, it's true. Wash your hands. Peace and motherfucking wash your hands. Yes.